if your printer supports wired or wireless networking, you'd probably prefer to share it among multiple computers rather than have it tethered to a single computer via USB. As long as you have a wired or wireless router, the setup process is fairly simple. First, connect your printer to the router. If your printer has an Ethernet port, you can connect it directly to one of the ports on the back of your router. If your printer supports Wi-Fi networking, you will usually need to go into the Network Settings menu to connect to the existing wireless network, including entering the network password. Some printers require that you install software in order to connect to a wireless network, so consult the manual if you're not sure. Once the printer is connected to the network, you'll need to add it as a new device for each Windows computer. Click the Start button and choose Devices and Printers. You will see a list of devices already configured. Click Add Printer to start searching for the printer. Click Add a Network, Wireless, or Bluetooth printer and wait a moment for the Windows to find the available devices. Your printer should appear in the list. Click its name to select it, then click Next. In most cases, Windows will search for drivers and install them automatically for you. Once the drivers and software have been installed, you can change the name of the printer in the printer name box if you wish, then click Next to continue. Check the box if you wish it to be the default printer. Click the Print Test Page button if you wish to test the printer, or just click Finish to complete the process. Your network printer is now available for printing and will also show up in your programs like Microsoft Word as an option. Be sure to visit inktechnologies.com for all your toner and ink needs, where we can help you save money with every print.